Described as a true lion of England and a fighter extraordinaire, Kingsman Sean Dawson was a sniper from the Duke of Lancaster's regiment on deployment in Helmand Province. He was shot during a gunfight with insurgents in the Musakala region on Valentine's Day. In a love letter to his girlfriend before he died, he told her, "I've just got off the phone to you and I can't stop crying now. I've heard you, babe. I love you. I'm really scared now." His body was repatriated just days after his death. Stricken with grief and with pain etched on their faces, Sean's mum, dad, and sister earlier made their way into St Paul's Church in Staleybridge for his funeral service. Army colleagues, representatives from the British Legion, and old school friends watched as, draped in the Union flag and with his hat on top, his coffin was carried inside. The circumstances surrounding Sean's death are still being investigated by the army. It's suspected he died in so-called friendly fire. But for family, friends, and colleagues, the focus today was paying their respects and their tributes. Kingsman Sean Dawson was an immense loss. We were talking here about one of the most courageous men I think I've ever come across in my time in the army for 24 or so years. And I say that、um, wholeheartedly and with evidence. I mean, this is a soldier who fought in the boxing ring back in November, in between going in and out of Afghanistan, and we awarded him. I awarded him a prize, the,、um, which will now be known as the Dor- Dawson Trophy, which is a big silver lion, which represents exactly the sort of man this man was: courageous and a winner. He was a very courageous fighter, as we know. Again, one of my fittest, one of my finest. Following his death, hundreds of friends joined a Facebook group in memory of Kingsman Dawson. One poignant tribute reads: "A great lad, a friend, and true hero. So many owe so much to so few. Rest in peace, brave patriot." Michael Billington, Channel M today.